Right? No. Do you have removable dentures or crowns? No, not okay. yet. <laughs> All right. Um, do you wear a nicotine patch or a patch with medication? No. No. Okay. Do you have any implants, anything held in place by a magnet? Okay. Would you like to use a toilet before you go? On? No. <laughs> she said. All right, so please go on through. Um, Fiona Shaw is about to go inside a huge scanner to have her brain analysed while performing characters from T.S. Eliot's poem, The Wasteland. Psychologists want to find out what, if anything, goes on in her brain when she performs the roles, in contrast to when she counts a series of numbers. Mind Earth about tonight? Yes, that. Stay with me, speak to me. Why do you never speak? Speak. What are you thinking of? What? Thinking what? I never know what you're thinking. Think. If they can find changes at some area of the brain at the moment that one kind of speech is happening versus another type of speech, yeah. I find that absolutely brilliant. Yeah. I mean, there are also things about the brain that I'm sure that the scientists can reply to, which is that um, I learned As You Like It about 25 years ago, and I think I can do it all now still, but a play I've done three years ago, I can't do. You're often in a visual uh, architectural mm. space in your head. In order to remember it, I can't remember plays I'm in, even when I'm in them, if I'm not in a stimulus, a, st a stimulated environment, I can't do it. We run the risk, of course, that she doesn't look any different when she's doing the West than <laughs> when she's counting because she's so familiar with it. I mean, I'm, I'm hoping that that's not the case. That there's, I'm certainly listening to what she's doing in there. She sounds very different when she's doing these different people. So I'm hoping that there is really some different register of this in her brain. And is there a sense that when she shifts between characters, her identity, in some mysterious way, shifts too? Well, this is something I've heard actors say. It does seem to be quite sometimes a difficult thing to distance yourself from having found the right voice for a character, a right identity for a character. Where you stop and they start it can be a blurry thing that can be hard to actually manage. So you are, you know, shifting notions of yourself along with the character that you're playing. So do you think actors' brains are different from ordinary mortals? I think actors' brains are like musicians' brains, that they've been trained to uh, learn enormous sections of language, but not by rote, but by imaginative association. 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. The green blobs on these scans of Fiona Shaw's brain highlight the parts of the brain that are used by everybody when they speak. They control the motor skills, lips, mouth, tongue, in producing words. When Fiona is counting, she's using these. What should I do now? What should I do? I shall rush out of there and I'll walk the street. But the orange blobs are really interesting because they show that there is something special that actors do when they perform a role. When Fiona is reciting from the wasteland, part of the brain called the infraparietal sulcus is being used, but not when she's counting. Actors use this bit of the brain to help them visualise the role they're performing. It helps them learn their roles and recite effectively. What have the psychologists learned from this experiment? that when actors put on voices and bring a character to life, they do something very different from the rest of us. And that, amazingly enough, there's a lot more going on in their heads than you might think. It's a very handsome brain. It is a particularly handsome brain. I think, brain. as brains go, I'm so <laughs> pleased it's there. Yes. Everybody needs to be from now on, I'd like to do it while they're in a brain scanner, just to yes. see what it looks like. You know, well, what I've, been in, I've been in a brain scanner. Yeah. 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 So you've enjoyed it, though? I've enjoyed it very much, yeah. Great. Thanks yeah. very much. Thank you. <laughs> Cheers. Yeah, on YouTube, my brain. <laughs>